Hey guys, couldn't get my live to kick in this morning. It's a Monday, right? Um, good morning. So today is husband's birthday, and I said, what do you want to do for your birthday today? And he wants to go take the dogs um, to Sanibel and walk on the beach. So super fun. And um, so I have to get ready for the beach, and that includes my skincare and makeup routine because our makeup is basically skincare with color pigment in it and being waterproof I'm able to go to the beach and sweat and swim and whatever else and also have that important UV protection that I don't have to reapply so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I do for my morning beach routine um, just a quick tip for you guys because it is getting into you know summer and I've noticed that you know coming from Maryland where it's very gray a lot of the time um, I wasn't wearing sunglasses as often but down here I have to wear them like every day especially when I'm driving and if you'll see like I have like a little blemish right here on my nose um, and then that reminds me that I need to clean my sunglasses so we don't think about that we put our sunglasses on we drive like especially when I get out of the gym how gross is that and my face was all sweaty and nasty put my glasses on I drive home and then I either put my glasses back in the holder in my car or in my purse sorry about that and then I take them out again and put them back on my face. So that dirt and oil and debris and bacteria is going right back on my nose and this is exactly where they sit. So just keep in mind that every now and then keep like a little hand sanitizer um, in your purse and just, just put some on the, the your glasses or you can wash them too. But it's really important to kind of disinfect them because if you keep wearing them over and over again, um, it you'll, you'll start to break out, especially under the eye and on the nose because that is where they are touching your face. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of spot on acne treatment. This stuff's awesome. It literally, like this is all you need, a little bit. And it's actually probably too much for this little spot. And it just, it'll zap it, it'll be gone by tomorrow. So I won't have to worry about it. But just keep that in mind when you are wearing like sunglasses or anything over and over even like your watch you know and your cell phone oh my gosh especially your cell phone because you put it next to your face okay so it's important to clean that off with just like an alcohol swab or something um, every now and then because your makeup or your oils on your skin or whatever is getting on your phone and the same thing with your watch too if you leave your watch on all the time make sure that you're taking it off and cleaning it just so you don't have any bacteria build up underneath that because it is pressed to your skin all day okay so first things first climate control oh my gosh <clears throat> you guys um i was spraying it on my face but i've started to spray like three pumps in my hand and then just kind of rub it in my face and I don't rub hard I just kind of pat you just want to get it into your skin climate control is a miracle in a bottle it's excellent for hydration redness rosacea um, psoriasis eczema this is my eczema go-to right here um, and then always the excess goes on the back of your hands ladies do not miss your neck decollete and the back of your hands there's no reason to wipe off this liquid gold product use every drop that you took out of the bottle all right next up we're gonna do the normal to well I'm normal to oily but um, whatever daytime moisturizer formula you are I do um, one and a half to two pumps and I I do a little more especially when I'm going to the beach because this product is going to provide an SPF equivalent of 15 just by itself but we're gonna layer it because I want extra sun protection when I know that I'm gonna be outside all day and this is not gonna be a waterproof product so you can't just apply this and then go sweat or jump in the pool um, you want to make sure that you're getting and guys, I apply this to my lips too, if you're noticing. Um, I always clean off my lips before I apply lip scents. And your lips are skin too, and you want them to be healthy, so there's no, there's no reason why you can't apply your skincare to your lips. Let it soak in, and then by the time you're ready to apply your lip scents, which is usually the very last thing that I do, um, you just clean your lips off and all of that product is absorbed because remember our products don't just sit on the skin so they don't feel super heavy because they're going into the layers of your skin where it needs to go. Okay, so that was a daytime moisturizer. It comes in four different formulas, dry, normal to dry, normal to oily, and oily to acne. I actually started with oily to acne because my face was such a mess and now I am normal to oily. Okay, following that, we are gonna do the color correcting tinted moisturizer. Um, I use light because I haven't seen the sun, but I can use medium and I'll show you both today. I usually do at least one pump 
of this because this is what happens. This is a physical shield for your skin. So what you wanna make sure you do, and I'm gonna put a little bit of medium on the other side here so you guys can see the difference. I'm just gonna do, whoops, a little bit of medium here so you can see the difference. So light and medium. Um, but you wanna make sure that you're putting enough product to basically cover your skin because that is what is gonna protect you from the sun. So we're gonna go and we're gonna apply this under my eyes. And I, I you, if you guys, most of you know that I went through chemotherapy topically for pre-cancer on my face last year. It was not fun, it was terrible. I'm gonna rub the medium in here. And I don't ever wanna go through that again and I don't want any of you to have to go through that either. So make sure that you are using sun protection so you guys can see there's really not a whole lot of difference. Maybe the medium is a slightly darker, but remember this is a tinted moisturizer. Hey Helen, good morning. So you don't have to worry about it matching your skin perfectly. You just wanna get it on there. If you are light to porcelain skin, get light. If you have a tan, get medium. And if you have very deep skin, we do have a deep tinted moisturizer for women of color who have that darker complexion. So doesn't have to match exactly because it is going into my skin. It is not sitting on top like a foundation, which is what I'm going to put on next. You'll also notice that this is my foundation and this is my um, tinted moisturizer and you'll notice they're almost empty. We have these unique airless pumps that bring the product up to you so you don't have to sit there and shake it out. You don't have to let it sit upside down overnight and then open it up and it all comes out and you waste a bunch of product. So this is really, really nice and these pumps also allow you to get just like just like the teeniest little bit of product. So if you don't need a lot, you can control it with the pump. So I'm gonna take two pumps of foundation. And this is the original Make Sense Foundation. So we have original and we have the advanced anti-aging. The original is going to be best for oily skin and it is going to also be a little bit more water resistant or waterproof. It's not really waterproof. The difference is that waterproof means you can get something wet, rub it off, and it is not going anywhere. Water resistant means that if I go in the, if I go swimming, if I go snorkeling and I come out, my face will be perfect, but if I take a towel and I wipe it off, there may be some transfer of product. So as long as you don't wipe off your product with your towel, you're gonna be golden. So I'm gonna put some foundation on all over my face, and I usually put some on my decollete too because that's an area that we all forget. Like it's so funny when I see like shellers um, and they have like super dark, hyperpigmented decolletes and the top of their hands too because they never apply sunscreen to those areas, super important. I'm gonna take a beauty blender. You can use a brush. I just like to use a beauty blender and I don't have a mirror, so we're just gonna go with it. And if you'll notice, I'm not dragging the product around, I'm just patting it in. And I feel like a, a blending sponge, which you will get free with any foundation purchase you will get this one. This is by far the best one I've ever used, including the original Beauty Blender. So I love this. It's kind of like a memory foam, but it's like really, really soft, but not too squishy. So it's firm enough that you can really blend. And so I'm just tapping it in. It gives you a little bit more natural of a look. And because this is an oil-free product, You don't have to worry about it streaking because if you use a brush with an oil-free product, a lot of the times you get those streaky lines and that's super annoying. So I'm gonna do my chest here too and my neck. And I'm not doing a ton on my neck because I will be wearing sunscreen on my body today, but I like to just blend it in because this is where I get a lot of sun when you're on the beach, your neck and I don't wanna have an aged neck, especially when I get older and I wear lots of dresses or V-necks. You don't want people to see a bunch of skin damage because that's not pretty. All right, so once that's patted in, okay, um, I'm going to take my shadow, and this is my personal trick with shadow. 
Um, I'm going to take Sandstone Pearl, okay? Our shadow is also completely waterproof, budge proof, smudge proof. And this is what Sandstone Pearl looks like. So it's not white, it's off white. It's like a light sand color. And I'm gonna put this on my eyelids. Now, what you guys might not realize is when you're shelling, which a lot of us do, and you're looking down shelling, you are getting reflection. Even if you have sunglasses on, the sun can come down and your eyelids are the thinnest, most delicate skin on your entire body. And it's really important to protect that. So this is not only going to protect my eyes from the sun, but it's also completely waterproof. Now keep in mind, with a physical or mechanical sun shield, it's basically like putting a little jacket on your skin. You do not have to reapply. And that is why some of you are asking, you know, why can't you just wear sunscreen on your face? You absolutely can do that. But number one, you must reapply a chemical sunscreen. It works like a sponge and it absorbs the UV rays. So that's why there's SPF 15 or 30 or 50 or whatever. And once that sponge is absorbed and full, you have to reapply more sunscreen to absorb more UV. A lot of people don't reapply. Um, most people don't reapply on their face, especially me with oily skin, because when you're out there and your skin is oily and you're sweating and you apply sunscreen, it just smears all over your face. It doesn't get absorbed because you have that, that oily layer that's, that's preventing and protecting your skin. And then it also makes me break out a lot of the time. Our um, Senesun does not make me break out, hallelujah, but a lot of other chemical sunscreens do, which is why I've avoided them like my entire life. Okay, so that's that. Then that sandstone pearl matte. Now I'm gonna take candlelight. Okay, so candlelight is a little bit more peachy. So that's sandstone pearl here and then candlelight. So it's a little bit more peachy. It blends a little bit better with my skin tone. And I'm going to put this under my eyes as a concealer because again, your eyelid and the skin under your eyes is very, very delicate. And I do not want to get damage under my eyes. And just blend that out and it actually makes a great concealer too. I usually just use concealer when I'm doing my makeup, but sometimes I just go for shadow scents because it's completely waterproof. It won't crease, cake. Aloha, Lori. How are you? Good morning and happy Monday. So you can see that coverage is great. Then, okay, then because I had pre-cancer, which was really bad by the way, on my nose, I go ahead and use this almost like a zinc oxide, okay? But watch, when I blend, you won't even be able to tell that I have it on my nose, and it's giving me an additional layer of completely waterproof physical protection against the sun. Because I never wanna get skin cancer, and I never wanna have pre-cancer again because chemotherapy sucks. It was awful. You can go back and look at my pictures of my face rotting away. Okay, you can even put some of this on your forehead, you know, if, if, if that's where you burn or if that's where you usually get sun, this is just extra sun protection. And then, you know what guys, when you find that holy grail Genonia and you take a selfie, you're gonna look darn good. Yep. Ooh, dentist appointment. That's, I don't know. I think it's fun because my husband's my dentist, but most people don't think that it's fun to go to the dentist. Okay. So I'm gonna take a little bit of blush. Um, our blush scents will last you forever and a day. You need a pinprick, okay, a pinprick, like you pricked your finger, just like that. It looks like I pricked my finger, didn't it? Look how pigmented, okay? You can always add more. So if you put this on and your skin might be a little bit more tan than me and you're like, I don't even see it, Laura, that's okay, add some more. But don't goop it on there because all of a sudden, you're gonna have a mess. This is also gonna be waterproof, budge proof. It's gonna last you all day, unlike powder that usually comes off like in a second. Just like that. Isn't that a pretty color? It's cherry. I'm gonna put a little bit more on this side just to give me some color because my face is kind of all even toned right now because I put on the full coverage foundation and some concealer. Okay, there we go. 
And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some powder. This is natural. This is just going to set my face and I don't have a palette. So I'm gonna use the top of my climate control bottle. Comes in handy a lot. I unscrew the lid. You don't have to, you can use the brush that it comes with, but I prefer my fluffy brush. And I tap some product out on top of my palette. You can use your eye cream lid, your um, detox mask lid, and then I'm just gonna take my fluffy brush and I'm just gonna set this. Now, this also has anti-aging skincare in it. Yes, a powder. It is completely matte. It doesn't smell gross like powder usually does and it's gonna give me even more added sun protection. Keep in mind, I do not have to reapply anything that I just put on my face, nothing. All right, one more thing before we go is lip sense because I wanna protect my lips, right? A lot of people use chapstick with SPF in it. Again, it's a chemical SPF, so not only is the wax drying out your lips while you're at the beach, but you have to continue to reapply it. And if you're a lip licker, that chapstick will be gone in like five minutes. Five minutes, you're gonna be reapplying chapstick all day long. So, I'm gonna clean off my lips here. You see all that makeup that was on my lips and all my skincare? So, make sure that your lips are clean and dry. And I can't decide if I wanted to do summer love or summer fun today because these are the summer um, coastal collection from last summer and I still have them available and they're so beautiful. So I think I'm gonna do one layer of summer love and then put summer fun on top because we can layer these colors to get your exact shade that you want. Okay, so this is summer love. And I'm just doing one thin layer. How pretty is this color, guys? It is gorgeous. This is a little bit warmer of a pink. Thin layers, we wanna do three. Three layers is what we're gonna do. We're not gonna rub our lips together. We're just gonna let it dry. Three layers is gonna protect us from the sun all day. You can eat, you can drink, you can swim, you can snorkel, you can kiss your husband, kiss your dog, kiss your kid, you're good to go. All right, summer fun. Okay, I'm gonna do two layers of summer fun because I really like this color. And I couldn't decide, so I did both. And keep in mind, it's really important to let them dry completely in between, just like painting a wall. If your paint isn't dry and you put another coat on, then it's never gonna dry. And I'm not going back and forth, back and forth. I'm not going like this. I'm just doing one swipe. Like that, let it dry. Ooh, California, that's fun. Is he surfing, Lori? Is that like a surfing event in California? I love California, it's so pretty there. Really expensive to live though, apparently. But it's really pretty there. I was just there in January. All right, so this color, I love it. Okay, let's do another layer of Summer Fun. So Summer Fun is a frost, so it is a frosty color. Um, you're gonna get some reflection from both of these colors. They're both frosts, so they're not matte, but if you're going to the beach in the sun, you want a little, want a little shimmer. Hey, Audrey, good morning. Audrey, I'm in Naples, we gotta get together. And have you tried some of these awesome products? You will love them. Everybody needs lip scents in their life. All right, and that's the third layer. Even if you don't wear lipstick, you will when you try this. Because it is awesome. All right, now I need gloss, and I don't know if I have any. Uh-oh. Here we go. I have some gloss over here. So this is rose gloss. You can see it's almost empty because I like, I don't know, I always grab rose I don't know why. I have a lot of favorite glosses to wear on their own, um, but I feel like this gloss is just as, almost just as hydrating as glossy, but it's just fun because it's tinted. Yes, Audrey, send me a message. Let's get together. I'm going to um, Oklahoma Wednesday through Sunday for seminar for Cinegens, but after that I am freeze a bird. 
All right, so make sure it's completely dry, you guys. You should be able to touch your lips and it's not super sticky. It might be a little bit sticky, but it shouldn't be super sticky. And then on your high gloss, make sure you get the corners here. Because everybody forgets the corners and it'll start to break down your color if you don't seal that in with the gloss. Mm. Everybody's bags were checked and the only the only allowed chapstick I I trap with all my makeup. I well not all of it, but I have lip scents in my purse, glossy in my purse, um tint and moisturizer in my purse because I carry that everywhere with me. Um and I have an empty um Senna serum bottle like this that I refill with our advanced hydration body lotion. So I don't know, TSA is funny sometimes. Okay, so this is the look for the beach. Um, if I wipe my lip, nothing comes off. Nothing at all. If I kiss my, here, I'll kiss the paper towel for you guys. Paper towel. Nothing. Yay. Okay, it's amazing. Really. And I'm good to go. I put some gloss on because I just kissed it off. So... The only other thing left is I might put on some waterproof mascara. You can do your eyeshadow if you want to. Um, and then I'm gonna use Senna Sun for the rest of my body when we get there, um, just so it doesn't get like all over the car. But I will tell you guys um, that this product is white and it is very liquidy, if you can see, and it applies clear. Look at that. So you do not have to worry about streaking. It is so super light. It is non-oily, non-greasy. It has anti-aging skincare in it, and it smells so good. This is the only sunscreen I have ever used that I actually love the way it smells. So I'm gonna get the back of my neck too while I'm sitting here thinking about it. So this is this this is the sunscreen that I use. Is chemical. There we go. So you have to reapply because this is going to absorb the UV light. And once that absorption is filled up, you have to reapply it. But I can tell you that it is non-greasy, non-oily. It's not sticky. You can apply it to your face. I just like to have my physical shield on my face done. And like I said, if you run into your bestie at the beach or you find that awesome holy grail shell you've been looking for and you take a photo, you look great because I can't tell you how many times I've run into somebody at the beach and I'm like, oh my gosh, let's get a selfie together. And they're like, no, I have no makeup on. I don't look good. And they won't take a picture. So you don't have that excuse anymore with this because you are going to look fly and you will be able to swim and snorkel. And I could jump in the pool right now and look just like this coming out. The only thing is my hair would be wet. That's it. Um, Bernadette, lip color chart. Yes, Bernadette, so if you go into the photo section, there's albums in this group under the Lip Sense album. It has every single color that I have available. Um, I'll tag you in the album, but yes, every single color. And then if you are interested in how like a certain color looks, like you're like, oh, um, you know, I wonder if Bombshell is really super light. You can just search for Bombshell in the group and it will bring up every post that has bombshell in it, including selfies of me, other people, and swatches on my hand. And I'm all, always happy to swatch for you guys too. Um, this, is, this is summer love, summer fun, and then sandstone pearl and candlelight. That's shadow, y'all. This is eyeshadow, and it is not going anywhere. Nowhere. Look at that. And it is completely waterproof. I don't have water but I have sunscreen. Look at this, watch. Look at that. It is not going anywhere. Hello, awesome, yeah. Put your sunscreen over your face because it's not gonna go anywhere. Okay, it is awesome. You're very welcome, Bernadette. I hope you guys have a great day. I'm off to celebrate husband's birthday today. He's 39. Um, I know. I had to say that because I think it's funny. Okay, but if you guys have questions, please let me know. Comment below or send me a message. If you want to place an order, send me a message. I have a fantastic C 
sale um, promotion and special going on right now for the final four products. So Nangai Oil, Climate Control, Lip Sense, and Color Correcting Tinted Moisturizer, all of which I put on today except for the Nangai Oil. Um, oh, thank you, Audrey. Yeah, he's so excited to celebrate today. And um, awesome sale for that. You can get 50% off the Detox Mask and the Polishing Exfoliator. So make sure that you check that out because that's amazing and you need this. Okay guys, I'm wrapping it up. I'm out of here. Gotta get the dogs in the car. I'll post pics. See you soon. Bye.